All right, you guys, today we are going to be doing one of my holiday looks in my series. I'll probably do about three or four for you guys. Um, this is the first one. It's not very dramatic, but it's definitely not subtle. Um, if you are somebody who wears a lot of neutrals, this is probably something that you would like to try if you're going for something with a little pop, but you don't want to look crazy and look like a completely different person. I personally wear very dramatic eyeshadow most of the time, so... Yes, I am going to go out looking like this in the daytime. I don't care. Um, yeah, but for those of you who do wear a lot of neutrals, this is probably something that you could try for like a nighttime holiday party. So I'll give you guys a close up. There is some gold glitter on the top. And I have lined the bottom with some blue glitter. I really hope you guys like it. And if you would like to know how to get this look on your face, then stay tuned. Okay, my entire eye space and my lower lash line is primed with e.l.f. eyelid primer. I'm going to take this shimmery base here, it's like an iridescent shimmery color, and put that on the entire lid. And the lower lash line. I applied the same tape that I used on the other side, just so that's not too sticky and it doesn't leave like a ridiculous looking mark when you remove it. And I am going to go ahead and take this brownish color here from my uh, New York Aziza palette. And I'm going to put that into my crease. small flat shader brush and I am trying this new little palette from my color theory kit this is the bronze and golds I'm gonna take this light center color here and put that into my brow bone Larger shader brush. Go into this goldish color. Put that on the inner part of the lid. Small precision brush. Into the lightest color in the palette, which is like a very light beige gold. Put that into the tear duct. Same larger shader brush, just using the flip side. Go into this bronze color. And pack that on the last part of our lid. Flat, short eyeliner brush into this darkest color, which is like a charcoal black with golden bronze reflex. going to place this color into the outer V and bring it in a little bit into the crease. Small flat top blending brush, blend that outer V color out. A little lash glue, almost to the inner part of your eye, basically just in that center part, but closer to the inner corner. Claire Glitter Tower. I'm going to take this gold one. A little bit of that and put it right on top of the glue. Idolize Cream Shadow Pencil by Wet n Wild. This is the navy blue one. The color is called Distress. Put that on the lower lash line. Back to the Glitter Tower. I'm going to go into this blue one. Very, very carefully with our finger, we're going to put that on top of the shadow stick. Sticking with our glitter look, we're going to take the Wet n Wild Color Icon in black. 
but this is the uh, shimmer eye pencil put that into the waterline we're not gonna set this because it's glitter and if we set it that's just gonna cover up the glitter you can go ahead and put this into the tight line as well Okay, that's pretty much it for the shadows you guys I'm going to clean up under my face with a makeup remover wipe do my eyeliner mascara and lashes and I will be back to show you guys the final look all right you guys I am back with the final look um just let you guys know really quick because I'm in like such a hurry for blush I use this purple one here this is Ziza desert palette I am loving this blush right now um to contour, as always, I use this dark brown from the Aziza Memphis eyeshadow palette. For lips, I used this, I messed it up, but I used this red Aziza lipstick. I'm so loving it for women of color. I'm actually going to do a giveaway and give one of these away because um, it is such a pretty red. Um, and then over on top of that, I used this lip gloss palette that hubby got for me just to use it i don't usually use lip gloss like that but because he thought of me when he went out and got it for me i put this one in the center of my lips and then i put this one up over top of it give it a little shine these are not pigmented at all so they didn't really give any more color so basically what you see is the lipstick and yeah this is the final look i really really hope you guys enjoyed my little holiday look for you guys nice and glittery give you guys a little close-up I enjoy doing it a lot, a lot. I'm in such a hurry, I didn't even do my hair, but I'm looking okay. So I'm going to go ahead and go out, have errands to run, and I have to get to the post office and overnight something, so it'll get there tomorrow. But as always on my channel, you guys, peace, love, and I will see you, ladies and gems, in the next video.